My best play is remaining with my Focus Sash, but quite frankly I just need the damage because it could very well be an R Belly Drum. Um. Alright, what's up guys? As always, welcome back to our last game of the Hypno Week. Going up against Lolo and we're going with, you know, the OU code, so... We are expecting some troubles. That said, I hope for the best and just... Uh, some... Like, this code has yet to prove me wrong, but this looks alright. Um, it, it's not a Sun team, that's for sure. But there are two things that stand out. First are two Steel types. And the other one is Fire. Like, generally, Fire is... <laughs> Huh, I don't see a spinner, however, there are a defogger in Scissor and uh, there are a magic bouncer in Espeon, which actually could be somewhat annoying. That said, the team is absolutely defeating my team, right? That's There is not a whole lot I can do versus this. I kinda hope that he leads off with um, something I can just damage. With Hypno, um, this team looks great. Like it looks, even though it is theoretically, you know, not as well synergized and let's say mine, which is definitely not what I mean. But I'm, it, it's not, you, you know, your OU standards yet. It looks really solid. Just what I'm trying to say. Um, all right, versus a Rojum, I kind of want to switch through on this, hoping it's defensive. It could very well be Scarfed. Consider Scarf Rojum has been very, very good this generation. Let's see. Volt Switch didn't do necessarily all that much. It's impossible to know it's if it's speeder me or not because, well, let's just face it, it's um, it's a Rotom. Uh, I think I was half expecting Frost last, I'm sure, trying to get the jump on me, but I'm probably don't need it yet. Hypno is not a threat for him, however. Brings an Espeon, and I've probably created a threat for me myself. Huh, cool. Let's see. What are we exchanging here? Because I'm pretty sure I put myself in in an absolute killing position. Um, I got leftovers. Hell yeah. That's not going to be annoying. Uh, we didn't see likely though, so I, I, I pretty much assume it's not... Um... Fuck, I screwed myself on, did I? I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it's not a screener. <laughs> So let's see, how much will I, well, so, oh, John, locks himself into John? I don't know about that. I do not know about that. You got us an Taurus on this. Why was that to play? Like, don't get me wrong, I just don't, I just don't understand it. By the way, I'm using the wrong type of Tauros. I realize that the best type of Tauros is a one with not work up as mine has um, because the best set is going like rock climb earthquake and then ice beam and fire blast or flamethrower i decided to go with work up i realize now that 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 set is uh, not as good as i initially thought now let's just find out if it's scarfed it is not my rock climb will do we will not find that out right because then um, how much will it do Oh, yeah, there we go. I hate this animation. <laughs> it is so weird. It is one of the strangest moves right now because of that. Let's see, brings in Scissor. Uh, now, depending on what type of Scissor this is, which is impossible to know, um, but I need to bring... Zolgo. My best play is pretty much scalding on this. And uh, I hope it goes for Bullet Punch. If he has Sword Stance, I'm pretty sure in theory lose to this. Gonna soak that, right? No. Did alright. That did a lot. So, best play here is Scald. Um, I'm pretty sure this invites um, the Rotom, which if I get it burn, I could. I just might as well kill it. And that would be nice. Just lock myself into some solid earthquake from Rhyperior. It doesn't look like I'm in there, however. And let's see, how much will this do? Show me damage on Scald. Get the burn! Right? No. Shit. Who wanna take a Volt Switch? 
Yippee Kai A is absolutely up there. Um, Bloodroot could maybe. I mean, it soaks to that the combination for sure. It just has a very tough matchup if Espion comes in, which all fans consider should be this. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. No. That's um, that's unfortunate. All right, so he has leftovers, which I should sleep powder here. I know Espion could be a switch in. Rotom won't be. Scissor, yes. Get him to sleep. Don't twenty five percent and then seventy five. Oh, I mean the odds are just here. They're just are in my favor. Somehow, um, probably shouldn't jinx that now. However, <laughs> but okay. Um, easy switching again. Solgo. Um, I assume my opponent's gonna try to U-turn out. I've yet to see like roost and stuff like that. But this is definitely a terrible matchup for me, even if. I'm in here, like... I like that I have both Thunder Wave and Sleep Powder, and yet they have not... Like, I have yet to ruin that aspect going on, but... We'll see what happens. Right now I have a few free hits in me, and I assume he has Roost. I also assume that, like I said before, uh, on my previous video, that... Um, I'm relying too heavily on my defensive backbone, and... Um, it's kind of frustrating because I really don't like playing this passive, I don't think. It doesn't suit me, I kind of want to advance the matchup, but right now I'm doing that through hazards. And um, I have yet to actually be successful in that too. Um, I hope he doesn't Volt Switch because I want to go for a solid Focus Blast here. Yubikaye, come on. Volt Switch, that, I don't want that to happen. <laughs> so let's see it didn't do too much though it probably is a magnet pull with this in mind goes to Zumeril. yeah versus this I clearly attack this right that's um, because if it is a belly drum set then my best play is as follows really to bring in my um Yep, Psychic. Um, my best play is remaining with my Focus Sash, but quite frankly I just need the damage because it could very well be an R Belly Drum. Um, yeah. About that. Wait. Where's the Citrus? He's left? Oh, no! That's not gonna fly. I'm gonna abuse that. That's, um... You're supposed to be Citrus. I am half expecting... Him to go for an Aqua Jet. And I'm gonna absolutely ruin that play. And now it's whether or not I want speed. I am... In theory faster. Your Slash should definitely help if so. Yes. This is... This is strange. This is very strange, that that was never the play. Why weren't you Citrus? I ate your play. I never thought I'd say it, but I absolutely did not care for that at all. Right. He's gonna Volt Switch again. I wish I had more solid switch-ins. I mean... This Blood Root is not going to do anything besides, well, I guess ensuring that Volt Switch is going to go to uh, Scissor and then they're going to bring Solgo and I am absolutely so passive. Why can't I get my main mod to just come in and attack, right? I mean, he's clearly dying. Alright, I need to, I need to shift my own momentum. Scissor's going to come in, he's going to sleep for one turn. Maybe two, and I'm gonna get to jump on. He has yet to burn a turn of sleep, right? I've yet to see it at least. 
because I can always strength sap and whatnot versus this, but I really want to break through. Now, it, it's, it's gone on long enough. I might be putting myself in a very dumb position, but as of right now, I need progress. Because I pretty much ensure that my opponent has not been able to make progress in 10 minutes. W wakes up! No! No, Sword Stance, that's, um... That's not great. Um, right? Uh, oh, wow. Let's see, the Bullet Punch will do... I'm Solid Rock, right? That should save me? No. <laughs> oh, come on! That was a crit! <laughs> Not that I know whether or not that would have been making a difference, but hell, fine. That's what I get from trying to make progress. You know what? It's not the end of the world. It's just frustrating. Um, mainly because I know my decision of making that play is the reason I'm now put in an awful position. Um, gotta hope for some yellow magic, I'm sure. Or actually, you know, if I lose now, I think it's fine. Like, like I said, I kinda prolonged this matchup far enough already. So... If I had to say something to kinda ease my mind, I would say I probably should have... Um, let's put it away first. Um, because, yeah, I absolutely lose now. There is no way I can hurt this guy, right? He can just keep sword stancing if he has access to roost. I'm pretty sure this kinda wraps it up. Shouldn't skull though, I should go for flinches, right? He is thinking about it, which is strange. Alright, who withdraws? Don't know why. Magnuson. Oh hell yeah. Question is, how do I want to go about this matchup? Burn him! Where are my hacks right now? Alright. Sending in Yippie Like I said, I wanted to speed this up. I lost Frostless right here in the process. So I'm, I'm kind of going to say jokes on me, but at the same time, um, I wanted to make some. But where is. Why are I getting these types of hacks? I love them. But yeah, like I said, I clearly was advancing for these types of, um, of hacks. So I'm not like. Frustrating the scenario, but rather shit. I wanted to make some proper progress and right now. I'm not getting it Now I could assume this is scarfed <coughs> But for the sake of actually trying to wrap up this game because I already made that type of progress I'm going to send in Torision He should be scarfed though, right? No, he isn't. All right, cool. And, um, well, let's think about this. Espion is left, which I speed tie with, depending on the set. Rotom is slower, so Tauros is definitely an apex Pokemon versus this. Grand Thread did I actually beat. Oh yeah, he had Ninetales. I remember. And it's a Flash Fire Nine Tails. Huh. Well, I really can't do much here besides sending in Solgo, I guess. I'm going for it. Earthquake should definitely hurt. Oh, it absolutely nailed it. Sashed? No. Huh. I am absolutely in range for. For a bullet punch, so I'm kind of surprised that's not been the play so far. We got the yellow magic and everything here, so I don't know. But yeah, Solgo again. <clears throat> if he's smart, he U turns on this. He has yet to see like Fire Blast and stuff like that. Um. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Air Slash in here, for sure. Stays in. So I'm going for flinch and parahax because I'm just that type of guy. And I'm basically picking. I'll take either. He's leftovers. Huh. 
He should send in Espeon. If I were him, I'd send in Espeon. For sure. I would not get myself willed down here. Got to flinch. And I'm pretty sure Scissor is no longer switching. However, it should be able to manage at least one more hit. Para flinching with the Mantine. Ah, he got it. He got it. Still, though, I think it's a two hit KO still. We're not out of the woods yet. But this could hardly be his play, right? It could be. I mean, I... I have always a chance of missing, but he has a chance of flinching, so... You, you pick one. <laughs> Alright. How big is miss ratio? Yeah, we're absolutely keep going with this. And that's Scissor out, right? That's... He's not coming back from that. Huh. I'm not sure I agree with these plays at all. <laughs> But let's think about this. Mantine beats Espeon, probably, maybe not at all. I have no idea what his Espeon wants to do besides John, right? He is Specs, however, so it's it's not an easy switch in. He goes for John. He's locked into that, however. I'm not sure. I am not sure about this at all. Getting burned. Where are they? Where are my hacks? I am. I rarely ask for them. Right now, I'm really want to ask the gods where they are because, quite frankly, this is weird. So I am not sure here. I, honestly, I made the progress. You know, switching Rhyperior. I got pretty much in theory reverse swept by this scissor who I somehow stopped. I don't know how, but I stopped it. And right now, oh, I should just go for an earthquake because everything else makes no sense. No, I should have rock lined. What if he switches out? What if he switches? No! 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 What have I done? What did I do? Why didn't I rock climb? Why? No! I am an absolute idiot. What I done? I faced myself. No. Nope. <laughs> oh, that that wasn't. I should just have rock like why? Why didn't I? I am severely crippled. I never know when I'll attack here. I checked this mod for sure. That that that's definitely for sure. But I. Oh shit. Um. <laughs> I don't know how badly I turned this, but I am definitely... I should not have got myself into this position, that's for sure. Alright, break through. Break through. I need you to break through. Plume? Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Oh, three minutes left, that's for sure. Um... Oh, shit. Why didn't I rock like... Why would... Ah! <laughs> Just playing with the idea right now that I had a rock line, I would have just resolved this situation completely. Um, I have no idea what Psychic will do to my Zolgo, that's for sure. It is Specs. I am special defensive to an extent, sure. But... Ah... What have I done? I'm feeling like Anakin right now when, you know, he... he that when he like, betrays his Jedi cause of what I done? No! That was the worst play ever. He's thinking about it though. Let's see. How much will this psychic do? I have been worried about this for some time. Oh, it was never a problem. Uh, that's how great this was. Oh, get the burn. This is. This is by far the strangest skulls I've ever made. Honestly, they're... He is splashing like... Just piss warm water on them. 
<laughs> They're not burning anything. All right, all right, we're we're still in this. Um, this could have gone in way darker than it than it did. Luckily, it didn't. But out of convenience, I definitely should should I give him the man sign and hoping that the timer alone secures my win. I, I guess I should. And I'm pretty sure that's speedier too. Come on, hit me! Would be real nice if he just went for a solid hydro pump just to kind of rub it in that he lost. I could still be crippled, however. I need to make sure that this Giga Drains come through. I'm pretty sure he can't beat me. He should be carrying Hex. If he has Hex, then yeah, he wins. <coughs> Let's find out. Hydro pump connects it. It does. Yeah, yeah, we're not doing this. Come on, hurt him. Valplume. He had shell bill, I realize that now. There we go. Nice GG. Um yeah. I'm pretty sure I kinda almost lost myself the game twice on this. First on Rhyperior, second on Tauros. I was my own worst enemy when it comes to having two two defensive backbone. I wanna make offensive momentum work. That was that was all on me. Anyway guys, as always, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed this Hypno Week, hope to bring something funnier next week, and uh, I'll see you guys next video. Until then, take care everyone, right?